Hello! So today I'm going to be talking about transportation in Japan since uh, it was asked about. Uh, there are three, three, yeah, main ways of getting around Japan. Uh, there's the trains, uh, there's the bus, and there are taxis. Um, and I'm lumping the Shinkansen in with the trains because you go to the same places to use them. Uh, there are bus stops pretty much set up in every town in Japan that each have their own scheduling. Uh, they're usually set up to go uh, either to tourist locations or to these various train stations. And you got to make sure that you know uh, where you're going when you're uh, at these train stations, at these um, stops, because... While there are towns like uh, where I am in Hirakata that get a lot of uh, bus traffic going through so that you pretty much never need to worry about uh, catching a bus, there are also towns that don't get much business and so their buses will come maybe once every hour or less. And in that case, you really need to know when your buses are coming so that you can be sure to get to where you're going on time. Because uh, that's the thing about Japan is that uh, while you can get anywhere, it's very time sensitive, so you have to make sure that you have these things plotted out. Uh, the other main uh, form like of getting around towns is taxis. I don't actually know the uh, rate for taxis in Japan. I myself haven't used them, but it seems to be um, fairly... Fair, fairly usable, seeing as I know quite a few people who have used taxis in the past, and doesn't seem to have run them completely dry, but it does not seem to be recommended. Um, trains. You can get to anywhere in Japan on train, given enough time and uh, money. Uh, most trains uh, cost around... Uh, 300 to 500 yen to get where you're going uh, if you're going a typical amount of distance. This is around a half hour travel time. Uh, but if you're going a bit farther, you can uh, expect to go uh, maybe as far as 1,000 yen. Uh, to get to uh, the airport from where I am, it costs uh, 1,400 yen. And that's because of um, how m like it's a special track and it goes quite a ways away from uh, where I currently am. Uh, the other thing is uh, Shinkansen. Now there there are Shinkansen that you can ride without booking in advance, but the thing to know about Shinken Shinkansen is they are rather expensive, at least if you're a student. Uh, a typical Shinkansen ride will cost you around $90. But you will get there, uh, get to wherever you're going in a much faster fashion. Uh, you can get to Tokyo from Osaka within three hours uh, or less uh, if you take uh, an en route Shinkansen, one that doesn't stop at every stop along the way. Uh, there's also something called uh, Yako Bus, which is night bus, where you book it in advance, uh, you go to a special stop at and then you get on the bus, and you sleep on the bus, and get off at your s stop. Um, these are interesting, and I recommend them for the longer trips. But because uh, the one I've been, the ones I've been on have been fairly nice, but they can get cramped, they can get crowded, and they can get awkward. Uh, because it's a lot of people usually shoved on them. There's also not a very good chance that you're likely to sleep well, if at all. Uh, so you need to take that into account when you're planning that. Uh, but yeah, uh, you can also do uh, local flights fairly cheaply in Japan. Uh, some running uh, around the $50 range on holidays uh, is really nice. You can get from go to Hokkaido or Okinawa very cheaply. Uh, yeah, that's really all I have to say about traveling in Japan. Uh, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, leave comments in the doobly-doo. I, I, I know people have been leaving comments for me on my blog and on Facebook, but please put them on YouTube. It makes it so much easier to keep track of for me, 
and then I can look at them all in one place, and it also allows other people to see your comments, so maybe if they have something that your thought triggers, then they can also add their own thoughts. Alright, yeah, that's uh, all I have to say today. Uh, have a good day.